no, no. that money, That's baby. Okay, I, I see That's, you. Uh, uh. Shady Gang, what's good? Welcome back to another show with August with the Shade. Listen, go ahead and grab your cups because, listen, we about to spill some tea and throw some major shade, okay? This video is going to be about Cardi B, Cash Doll, and Megan Thee Stallion. But first, I want to go ahead and give a shout out to our amazing sponsor, Spiritual Shit. Make sure y'all stay to the end of the video so that you can get your 22% off code, okay? Now, listen, this video has to be informative for all of the female rap heads and all of the Nicki Minaj fans because, guys, you have to realize when a snake is being a snake. Now, Cash Doll was somebody that I actually liked. Never thought she was a good rapper, but I did like her style, you know what I'm saying? And I love confident women. She is one of those girls that is very confident, okay? She is a 30 or 40 year old something rapper from Detroit, Michigan, okay? She came out with a couple of, you know, freestyles and really, really never reached the top. You know what I'm saying? Because once she put her, you know, Nicki Minaj's name in her mouth inside of her Instagram live, you know, that is when her career went down. But we're gonna get into that, okay? We're gonna get into why she's trying to come back on the scene because now she has a child and maybe she might not be, you know, brought back onto the show that she's on. You never know. So if, if her passion is to rap, then the best thing for her to do is try to be friends with the most cloudiest rapper out there. Right, so Cardi B and Cash Doll have not been friends since Megan Thee Stallion and her have been cool. Now, you know, back in the day, Megan Thee Stallion was cool with Nicki Minaj. Well, I don't want to say they was friends, but they had a little relationship. They were able to create a song, which was Hot Girl Summer. But after Hot Girl Summer, y'all see what happened when she did with what when she did the WAP video. Her and Cardi B became best friends. So. Her and Cash Doll was no longer cool. You know, 2019, it was chilling, it was hanging out and all that. But then it just stopped because Megan Thee Stallion, you know, the foot. <laughs> Megan Thee Stallion had to put her foot up in the gang and say, no, this is not what's going on. <laughs> Megan Thee Stallion said, no, no, no. So I want to say this. I feel like Cash Doll is using Cardi B to, you know, be friends again and possibly get her name back out there try to you know drop a song because if you see right here she wants to do a song with cardi b but megan the stallion is cool with cardi and i'm pretty sure if megan the stallion and partisan fontaine hasn't broke up broken up then possibly she would be a little mad about her chilling with his ex you know what i'm saying or somebody that he used to kick it with i'm just saying i think there's a bit a little tacky on cardi b's end because if cardi b wouldn't hung out with some of megan's ops or megan wouldn't hung out with some of her ops how would she feel what if her megan the stallion and Nicki minaj got back cool would cardi not be friends with megan i'm just saying let's just talk about it you know the female rap girls they like to get catty and i want to go ahead and start it all up so listen i want to know what y'all think down below i want to know what you think do you think cash Doll is trying to use cardi b to get back cool and in the game but do you think that megan the stallion is going to be mad because cardi b and megan is cool right so you know just let the snaking begin you know cardi b is going to see what a snake megan is in this moment because if cardi b starts getting mad like if they start hanging out because you know cash doll is a mother you know what i'm saying megan is a little thought so we don't know how this is gonna go but let's just see okay because cash doll is trying to get back in the game but she can't rap but we're gonna see what she can do okay like i said y'all leave y'all comments down below what do y'all think is going to happen okay like this video subscribe to the youtube channel make sure that you leave your comments down below make sure you turn your notification bells on so you don't miss every single time when i hit that live button or when i just drop a video you know what i'm saying and remember this video is sponsored by spiritual shit shout out to my girl spiritual shit listen if you want to get enhanced and like i said on the last video spiritual buy okay go ahead and use that 22 percent off code shady friday so that you can get yourself elevated all the way to the top okay and remember august and Rello sent you okay love y'all and, and remember also go and check out um, all of the links that are going to be down below for spiritual shit um, And remember she has a YouTube channel guys Make sure you go and check out her YouTube in real time Leave a comment, you know Let them know August and Rello sent you Love y'all Shady Gang, bye Hey, you know the barbs only do top floor, top notch That is why for the month of April Which is my birthday month and the month of 420, we are going to celebrate every lit wine sold with 22% off. That's 22% off of every lit wine purchase. Shady Gang, the reason why y'all over here with August and Rella is because y'all love exclusive content. Get you a lit wine, protect your nails, keep other people's fingers off of y'all shots elevate your intentional high shady gang 22 percent off 422 is also earth day what is the cannabis it is the earth so we're gonna celebrate it <laughs> love you boo thanks